hey guys welcome back to my channel it's marisa in today's video we are doing a crest buyer project share and review of these beautiful washi tapes the vintage washi tapes right here and these beautiful ocean themed washi tapes so let's get started Hey guys, so first of all, I just want to thank Crestbar for sponsoring another video and their website will be in the description below, okay? And I have a code MARISA5 where you could use at checkout and save $5 off of a $40 purchase. Also, I just became an affiliate of Crafts Buyer, so all the links to the products will be affiliate links, okay? Just to let you know that. Alrighty, so let's bring this camera down and I can just go over again these beautiful washi tapes that I received. So first are these vintage washi tape. This is very, very pretty and I absolutely love them. Look at the sizes of them. Just beautiful. Look at that butterfly. Just gorgeous. It looks like a poem written on it. Just absolutely gorgeous. And then we have these right over here. I love that, that kind of tan one with all like the cookware. I just love them all. Just very, very cool. They complement each other wonderfully. And here is the alphabet one. And then you have just some sayings on this one, Twinkle and Lullaby, okay? And I'm gonna do one project share with the vintage washi tapes and then one project share with the ocean washi tapes. And that one right here, I'm saving that one again for a um, giveaway, okay? When I hit 1K, guys, very close. So these are the ocean theme washi tapes. Look how beautiful these are, all the different colors, the blues and the greens, the sea green, the whales, the starfish, just everything. Uh, you see little crabs there and seaweed and all different types of fish. Just absolutely beautiful and beautiful to use. So yeah, I'm going to do a project share with each one. I'm going to show you in a second. And all these, I believe those are 20 in a pack. Yes, there's 20 in this pack right here. Look at the detail on them. Just very, very pretty. And I really enjoyed using them. I have some great stuff that went along with it. I have some beautiful papers and ephemera that went perfectly with these beautiful sea themed washi tapes now these i really got inspired i had some again some really cool paper that i just got from aliexpress just call me washi fingers okay <laughs> i just have washi tape all over my fingers but this is the easiest way to show you up close how beautiful i really enjoyed using these these really inspired me to make something really really cool i made two easel cards basically my second and third easel card i've ever made so these just inspired me to make something really really cool so i enjoyed using them and i really recommend them if you want to try them for yourself so let's go okay guys i am moving this out of the way i need to show you these really cool i had so much fun and i really put a lot of effort into these cards i cannot wait to show you my project shares so let me get them out so this is the first one ah this is an easel card and you just fold it like that and then you pop it up just like that I absolutely love making these easel cards so look at this washi tape how beautiful it complemented all the ephemera I had 
I just used some extra ephemera, of course, papers, some nice cream colored paper, and that beautiful glitter paper. But look at that gorgeous, gorgeous washi tape. I used lighter paper so that the washi tape would pop so you could actually see it because darker papers you cannot see. And that was all um, cream colored paper underneath. And my favorite is that gorgeous wave paper. It reminds me of that famous painting, The Wave. I forgot the name of the artist, Japanese artist. But look how gorgeous that is. It really looks like watercolor. I love that jellyfish. It just magnificent washi tape. Absolutely magnificent. So this is what I added. Uh, this is some of the ephemera. I forgot where I got this. Maybe Hobby Lobby, but I'm not sure. But that is some of the ephemera I used. And I use this paper here called Mermaid Dreams. And I believe that is definitely from Hobby Lobby, the paper studio, if I am not mistaken. I use that pretty bubble paper and I accented perfectly with the washi tape. So and here's the back of it, that beautiful sparkly blue paper. And yeah, that is the, uh, and then right there on the front there, you can write a little message. So... If you want to learn how to make the um, the actual card, go check out Gina from Gina Loves to Craft. I will link her channel below because she did a great tutorial, a very easy tutorial. If it wasn't for her, I would not have to know how to make this really cool card. So I am loving the easel cards. I'm loving this washi tape. And if you love anything beachy or sea creature, I highly recommend uh, this washi tape, honestly. You could do so much with it. Okay, so next up is the Vintage Washi Tape Project Share. And look at this. Uh, I enjoyed making this card so much. It just I was thinking of my grandmother, just stuff that she had old... Um, you know photo albums that I grew up with look at that so you fold it down and then again you pop it up and I use some really nice kind of like uh, brown uh, cardstock and I love these washi tapes they just popped with the colors that I use very uh, neutral and I actually used all of the washi tapes in this project so I was able to incorporate all of them. So you have that star one right there. So you have the little hand holding that. I just kind of wanted to make it look like a really vintage antique um, old photo album. So here is all the rest of them. The numbers and the hands pointing. I just love the way this came out. And I put little pearls on the side there. The flowers. And here is the back. You could actually put a message right there in the back if you wanted. Or you could put in that little space there in the center. A little like happy birthday or I'm thinking of you. Something like that. So I'm going to show you what I used to go along with the washi tape. So I got these two from AliExpress. I got this vintage paper. So I said, oh, this is perfect timing. And it actually came uh, on the same day. So the Craspire products came and the AliExpress came. And I got that from AliExpress as well, some vintage ephemera. So it was perfect timing. And I had these stickers already. I have two uh, sets of these stickers. And that's from Hobby Lobby. Again, vintage stickers. So finally, I have everything. And here's a little butterfly. That was from the ephemera and the stickers there. So everything, I had everything perfectly coordinated to go with this washi tape. And I am just so happy with myself and this project, how it came out. And there it is. I added that beautiful black flower. I had those flowers for quite some time. I was just kind of waiting to see what I could make with them. So those are my two projects. So I'm really happy with, they, with the way they both came out. And please let me know in the comments below what you think of this washi tape. And sorry guys, I'm just trying to fix this camera again to give you a better angle so you can see both cards and all the washi tape together. Okay, so that's it. 
so thanks again to Craspire. Guys, don't forget, you know, you could find all their stuff and their products on their website. It will be in the description as well as the links. And um, yeah, it's links to these beautiful products. And don't forget about my code. So thanks so much for watching, you guys, today. Do not forget to subscribe and hit the notification bell so you never miss one of my videos. And guys, I will see you in the next one. Bye.